It was an atmosphere of colors and rich cultural display as members of our Kwaibon community in Anambra State celebrated their 2023 end of the year carnival and awards ceremony. The celebrants were all adorned in various traditional attires depicting various constituent heads of their town. Blessing Uchendo filed the report. The cultural carnival, which took place at Dr. Massa of Famata Villa, is Sofia Anambra local government area, attracted government functionaries, traditional rulers, all the indigenous of Akwaibon State living in Anambra State, including students' association from Nanda Izikiwe University, Oka, and Federal Polytechnic, Oko, friends and well wishers from Anambra State, who trooped out in their numbers to watch the people of Akwaibon State showcase their cultural heritage. Speaking, the Transition Committee Chairman of Agwata Council Area, Dr. Chibes of Fobike, urged them to continue to support the government of Anambra State, support the peaceful coexistence in the state, and give testimonies to their people about the good disposition of the Anambra and the peace in the state. I bring you greetings from the Agwata government area. I just want to say that um, you are welcome, first of all, and you are always welcome anytime. Any, anything you want to do here, you're always welcome to be uh, part of us. On his part, the traditional ruler of Isofia, Igwe Christopher Moaro, commended them for showcasing their rich culture. For the president of Akwaibom Community in Anambra State, Mr. Solomon added, The event is a yearly remembrance as they come together, thank God for his message throughout the year, showcase their culture, and pledged that the people of Akwaibom in the state will continue to support the good activities of the state government for the overall development of the state. Wherever you find yourself, whether in Ekulodia, whether in Isofia, whether in Aya, Melu local government, wherever, our charge is always remain a true Akwaibom mind that you are. So that's my charge today also. On his part, the patron of the association, Dr. Formata, who is also the chief executive officer of Amacon Global Company Limited, said that he grew up in Akwaibon State and that they are known for peace and urged them to continue to maintain cordial relationship with their host communities. Integrate with the community. Today they will be integrating with all communities in Anambra State. That's something wonderful. They will be eating on the same table. Uh, and that's something great. You know, that shows their home. And there are no more strangers here. Earlier in a Thanksgiving Mass at St. Patrick's Parish, is Sophia, the vicar, Reverend Father Emmanuel Ohebu, said that as the year is coming to an end, Christians need to work hard, be awake, vigilant, wise, and consecrate themselves to God. The village head, Ndiya Etong, Econo local government area, Etigon Isong Abakwe, a member of board of trustee of the group and indigenous of Akwaibon State, Reverend Father Jude Iniabasi, described Anambra people as hospitable and accommodating dating, adding that they will continue to preach peace wherever they are living in the state. The event featured Thanksgiving, March past, local wrestling, unveiling of Almanac, showcasing of Akwaibom delicacies, award presentation and colorful Akwaibom cultural displays.